Now to our GMA cover story, as outrage grows over Harvey Weinstein and those sexual misconduct allegations, we're taking a closer look at the woman by his side, his wife and fashion designer, Georgina Chapman, and ABC's Lindsay Davis is here with more on that. Good morning, Lindsay. Good morning, guys. This morning, the 41-year-old English model turned fashion designer has been married to Weinstein since 2007. And while Weinstein initially said she stands 100% behind him, according to People Magazine, she is now furious and worried not only that her marriage might suffer, but her business as well. As Hollywood royalty now lines up to condemn ousted movie mogul Harvey Weinstein, there is one woman standing by him, his glamorous British wife, Georgina Chapman. In the hours after the scandal broke, she is seen here in this DailyMail.com video, smiling and exiting her $15 million New York City mansion she shares with her now disgraced husband. But sources tell People Magazine Chapman is now furious and embarrassed. She is very upset, but not rushing to file for divorce. This doesn't even seem like an option. The two have been married since 2007. Parents to a four year old son and seven year old daughter. Her fashion house, Marquesa, was established in 2004, the same year she started dating the studio mogul. Weinstein is often a fixture at her fashion shows, seated right next to the queen of fashion herself. Chapman's designs now outfit Hollywood royalty. I'm wearing Marquesa. The dress is Marquesa. From Sienna Miller's iconic look to Sandra Bullock's gold dress she wore to accept her Academy Award. This morning, People Magazine is reporting that Chapman is very focused on Marquesa. It's a family business, and she will do what she can to keep her personal life away. The fashion designer's most recent Instagram posts feature her bridal collection, which debuted mere moments after the New York Times' explosive report hit. Her Instagram reportedly received a barrage of negative comments that have since been deleted. In the past, Weinstein has been credited with helping to get A-list stars to wear the Marquesa dresses on the red carpet. So we'll see what, if any, fallout arises there. Another woman defending Weinstein, fashion designer Donna Karen. When asked about the allegations, she said, when you look at how women are dressing and presenting themselves, what are they asking for? Trouble. Likely that'll create some backlash as well. I think that's probably right, Lindsay. Thanks very much. We're here with the executive editor of People Magazine, Kate Coyne. What was Dana Karen thinking? Uh, she's already backpedaling pretty furiously on that statement. Uh, you know, she she's saying it was out of context. I'm not really sure how that applies, but uh, she's profusely apologizing for the way her words were construed and saying that, of course, you know, no one is ever asking for it and that sexual harassment is something that needs to be taken very, very seriously. And she deeply regrets uh, the, the comments that she made. So far, at least, Regina Chapman's standing by her husband. So far, she is. Uh, a source has told us, though, that divorce does seem inevitable. Uh, inevitable. I, inevitable. I think. I think sooner or later. Uh, let's just put it this way: if you have me back here in one year, I don't think we will be talking about them as a, as a unified couple. And, and what's the blowback for her fashion line? It could be considerable. Uh, she is not somebody. Uh, she's not uh, a Karl Lagerfeld, someone who's very connected within the inner circles of, of power designers. She's not buddies with Anna Wintour. She's not somebody. Uh, uh, who who moves in in that world? Really, the celebrities who wear her dresses are thanks to Harvey to a large degree, and so uh, her label has depended quite a bit on the power that he wields in Hollywood, and that power is of course now obliterated. And for so long, it seems like he was protected by something of a culture of silence in Hollywood as well. But that dam has broken. Oh, it, it is 100% broken. Uh, you know, the casting couch goes back half a century, so uh, of course this has been going on for quite some time. But it only takes one person to step forward and open up those floodgates. Uh, and as you said, uh, the dam has broken, uh, and, and ideally there will be no turning back from, from this sort of revelation. Okay, Coyne, thanks very much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.